the indigenous solidarity sign. That means a lot to us in Canada because we understand, we understand from them about the colonization of a people and they are still fighting for their freedom. We demand that the government of Canada act immediately, immediately, for a ceasefire and to unconditionally stop the genocide. Canada should send food and medical aid to besiege Palestinian Gaza. The Palestinian people have a right to return to their homes with dignity and equality and peace. That is what the Palestinian resistance is about. The Palestinian struggle is against Israel's Zionist political program, which was established in 1947 when Israel took full control and occupied the land and subjugated the Palestinians. It is called settler colonialism. and carries at the basis of its program hatred, racism. That's what it is, racism. Hatred of the other. Look around. All of us can be friends. We can learn from each other. There's no hate here. Palestinians are called animals. The Jews were called subhumans. I'm a survivor of Adolf Hitler's Holocaust. As a Jew, I was mocked down for death. I was saved by the unity and solidarity of many individuals. and a whole community who hit me and thousands of others from Hitler's mass murders. Hitler's war against the Jews aimed to eradicate their history and the Jewish people themselves. Nazism is hatred of the other, it is racism. Colonialism was Hitler's program to conquer land for Germany. Gas chambers and the hundreds of concentration camps which starved and tortured and eliminated Jews by disease is repeated today in Gaza. It is repeated today in Gaza's concentration camp the largest concentration camp in the world. The death chambers and ovens have re been replaced in Gaza with tons of bombs that destroy all in their path. Gaza has become a death camp. The government of Israel does not speak for the Jewish people. Zionism is a racist ideology. Judaism has never stood for racism. Conflating Zionism and Judaism 
is criminal. It's an unforgivable crime. Not only to the Jewish people, but to the Palestinians and to humanity. We are all against racism. We're all against Israeli apartheid. We're all against the genocide. There's a witch hunt today against the defenders of the right of people to speak about Palestine in Canada. This is happening all over the world. Courageous people are losing their jobs and reputations because they speak for the freedom of Palestine. We must stand with them and their right to speak freely for freedom and against the hate and racism of the Israeli government. The Palestinian leaders of the World Movement for Boycott, Divestment and Sanctions, their platform states, and I quote, full equality for Palestinians and respecting, protecting, and promoting the rights of Palestinian refugees to return to their home. The Palestinians, that's, that's all they want. They want to live in freedom and equality. And they're being murdered for that reason, because of racism and colonialism. Today, insist, today, we insist that Canada's so-called leaders, include, including Justin Trudeau, take immediate action for a ceasefire and to unconditionally stop the genocide. Palestinian freedom is our freedom. Yeah. It is our freedom. Yeah. It is freedom for humanity. Yeah. We have to grow these demonstrations. We have to make them hundreds of thousands and we have to do it more and more. To we have to make it clear to these so-called leaders that they cannot rule without us insisting cease fire now. Cease fire now. End the occupation. 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 And the occupation, and the occupation, and the occupation.